Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, XR Hammer, and I'm going to be playing some Dragon Quest Builders for you. And in the last episode, we had... We did our base defense. We got these new people just come, and they were all ill. And, yeah. You know, it weren't great for me. This dude wants me to build a watering hole. I went and did a fair bit of farming, if I'm honest with you. I mean, I could take that out of there, actually, thinking about it. Have I got any wood in here? Yeah, no. But in here, I do have my hole. I managed to find fur, which we know what that means. I'm building the colossal coffer. <laughs> I'm definitely doing it. Loads more coal, loads of stone, load of wood. I got some leather sack. Well, one leather sack. Some mossy earth, you know, all of this good stuff. Hopefully without spoiling too much, you know, but when I went and picked the wood up It unlocked a load of new stuff like the sewing station, which I'm going to be building Because it looks awesome. What else did it unlock? Wooden floor, wooden walls uh, Yeah, I picked up some stone uh, some pumice pieces so I can make throwing stones uh, I might do that in another episode, but right First things first, let's get this colossal coffer made. Thank the Lord for that. Right. And this sewing station. Because it told me I can make a stone axe. But the problem is, there's nowhere for me to make a stone axe. It's very confusing. Right. Where shall... Oh. Did I plan this right? Look at that. I'm a genius, without knowing it. Oh, I've got to transfer everything over, haven't I? I'm not that much of a genius. <laughs> right, let me just pop this there for now. Can I make... Yes! Stone axes! Iron broadswords uh, broad already. Beautiful, right. Uh, I'm going to make three of these, I think. Look at the damage on them. 14 compared to 8. It's quite a no-brainer. 1, 2... 3... Beautiful. Ooh. So a shield. I'm going to make me a normal shield. Just get it equipped for now. Right, equipment. Uh, I'll remove that, remove that. Equip, 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 equip. Beautiful stuff. And then go into items, equipment. Put away, put away. Go into here. Delete the part used one. Leave the good one in there. And... Right. We'll do this little, you know, we'll go through it, guys. Why not? I think, guys, what I'm going to do is just speed it all along of me running back and forth. So, yeah. Cue the fastness. And right guys, now that that tedious job's over and done with, what did Matey Boy wanted a watering hole, wasn't it? I oh, know, you wanted the fishing rod. Who wanted, was it you who wanted the watering hole? Nope. Yes, right. We need a good supply of water, at least 10 blocks worth. 10 blocks of water, a comfy stool, a wash tub, a chest, two pots. Right. Let's have a look what we've actually got. We have a chest. Oh, actually, I need to take all of this stuff out. Right, so we've got a chest. Uh, uh, nothing else. Beautiful. Right, a chest. Where is it? Two pots. Comfy stool, a wash tub was it? Ah, uh, I just skipped it. Well done me. Yeah, a wash tub. 
What does it take to make a wash tub? Meh, yeah, I've got loads of material. Right. This little block here, guys, is amazing. Right, it is called, when I go onto it, a water crystal. When it's placed below ground level, it creates water. Right, it's as simple as that. It's amazing. So, they want at least 10 blocks. So I can go four, eight, five, six, eight. And I'm going to do two here just because I'm awkward. Right, and if I pop that there, I pop, look at that. Amazing, right? So that is at least 10 block. You know what? I'll do these two as well. I'm feeling generous. Right. <laughs> no, why did I put them other way? I need it. Let's put that in there. It's a very useful little thing. Right, now, let's design. Have a door right there. Why not? I need a door. I knew I was forgetting something. When I was reading it all off, it sounded very strange. Right. A door. A door. A door, a door. Right. A door. And we need pots. A chest. A wash tub and a comfy stool. Oh, we also need some lights. But I'm pretty sure I've got some torches. Yes, I do. Alright, so we'll do one here. And one here. That looks lovely. <laughs> it really doesn't. Right, where's... Whoa. Yay, you've got your own watering hole. Beautiful. If you want a clean bill of health, you've got to wash in clean water. Well, <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Something to scoop up water with. Uh, maybe a bucket. Palm lumber. Beautiful. I just farm loads of that. A bucket. Hey, scoops up water. Can be used repeatedly. Beautiful. Right. Let's go make. I've got some dirt. Let me fill in this water. Beautiful. A bucket. Beautiful. Let's make a bucket. Let's pop all of this stuff back in here. Sort it out. Let's go and use my bucket. Yes, scooped up water. Yay, now I can give it to this dude. Have it. <laughs> right, I completed L's little... T okay, something came into my base, clearly. And it got annihilated, clearly. <laughs> right. Eh. Right, let's go and complete some of these quests. Go through the teleportal. <laughs> Gotta love it. Right. Quest markers. All in front of me. Beautiful. Yeah, guys. I couldn't carry everything. But I went. I got rid of quite a lot up there. Uh, yeah. It was all good fun. And guys. Right. I missed it. I genuinely missed my shot. In this game. There is a silver slime right and getting this silver slime to spawn is it's really hard right the spawn rate on it is ridiculous you can run around for three hours and not see a single silver slime right and one popped up when i was farming he shot at me and disappeared i right. i was gutted genuinely gutted <laughs> hopefully the next time i see one it will be on camera and yeah it looked cool. It looked really sweet. But yeah, it wasn't to be this time. Where's uh? Got 
There we go. It wasn't opening up the um, bird's eye view. Did I just see a little place up here? I did indeed. We're going in there. 100%. Hello? Oh. Okay. I'm not quite sure what they do. Oh, wow. Look at that plaque. Okay, I need a key. Can I take the plaque? Yep, that's coming with me. <laughs> I have a decorative shield. Uh, is there no minions that are going to spawn up? Oh, I really want to know what's inside it now. Oh, it's so much easier. So much quicker. Right, where am I going? Still in a southeasterly direction. Whoa! What are you? Whoa! Why are you not friendly? Well, at least you're not too difficult to defeat and you drop fur. Right, bring it on, Mr. Wereman. Or Werewolfy Man. Beautiful. What? Whoa! That's what they do. They paralyze you. Um, that's not good. Is that going to impair like my fighting skills? Wow. Um, didn't look like it. Here's one quest pointer. Whoa, is he underground? Dude, what are you doing under there? Shall I read the up? Whoa. Whoa. Dude. Oh, wow, that's what paralysis does. Right, um, his name's Jacob. Do not touch your flowers. Really? Yeah, I kind of figured that one out, dude. Right, um, I need to eat. My food, well, my, my food. <laughs> my food is really low. My belly is empty. Right, what do you say? Secret exit in, in case of emergency, break wall. Um, okay. How much of the wall? Really? Oh, no way. <laughs> right, first things first. Oh, uh, come on, stop it, game, please. Okay. Paralysis really is irritating. I need to get rid of as much of this as possible. So, what does it mean? The sign was here. It said, in case of emergency, break the wall. And I'm doing that. And there's no exit out. Okay. Let me have a quick look. Ah, I can get out this way. Beautiful. Oh yeah, little pro tip there, guys. If you're stuck underground, and you know, you don't really know your way out, just open up your map. Beautiful. Right. Let's go and get Jacob. Let's carry him back to safety. All of the dirt. What I don't understand, guys. Right, he is paralysed. I was also paralysed about a second ago. And mine wore off. Why is his not wearing off? Hmm? It's open to discussions down in the comments, you know. I really want to know why this dude remains paralysed and I don't. I mean, I am meant to be some sort of legendary builder, but I can still get paralysed. I don't know. Right, let's go. Cue eerie music. Right, and this is why I put more beds down. Lay them down. Sardines? Um, on a stick? Um, yeah, I don't have them yet. Maybe that will be when I learn how to fish. Whoa, dude. How did I miss it twice? That pack it in. Whoa! Was that the throwing stones? Ha <laughs> ha, I'm gonna make me some of them. Right, let me... Just pop all of this stuff in here. Let's go and make me some throwing stones. Did I just make one lot? Let's make all of them. 30 throwing stones. Right, let's go find something to throw stones at. Whoa! 
Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. I love it. Yeah. Oh, you can't just throw like one after like rapid fire. And you can't throw them in midair either. You have to be stood still. Kapow. Ah. Well, they're not. Um, I don't know. They could be fun. Just to aggro enemies from afar, you know. Ah, when you when you can aim. Apparently, hammer can't aim. Really, I can't aim. Pow. There's such a long, like, animation on it. All right, come here, look. I mean, I can't hit again until then. I was literally spamming attack as well. But still, I can see them being loads of fun. Can I hit? Ugh, no. That would have been cool, though. And, yeah, guys, what I'm going to do is end the episode off here. I really hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. And I will see you all in the next one. Peace out, guys.